Hi Capricorn, welcome to my channel. I hope you are doing fine. Uh, this is a reading for both single and uh, people in relationship. Let me start with the single Capricorns. What is in the near future? What are the energies? You have Hierophant. You have Knight of Swords. And... What happened? The Hermit. You know, you feel that uh, people were not fair enough with you, okay? And they did wrong things with you. And uh, you feel unfair. You're fighting from that feeling. That feeling is. Uh, killing you from inside like why things happen with me why people are so unfair why the situation is unfair I'm not a wrong person then why these things happen to me you're taking impulsive decisions you are not grounded you are like in a very hurry buddy uh, very impulsive anger frustration because the things uh, were unfair with you because wrong things happened to you uh, you are in a very wishy-washy impulsive uh, anger kind of energy and you are taking uh, sudden decisions which which will affect okay and of course you're damaged you're guarded since people did wrong to you you do not want to fall for the trap again you have guarded yourself and you're hurt and damaged and you're just being alone and trying to look at the situations which happened you're replaying the situations and you're hurting yourself again and again you see the hermit mode you just isolated yourself uh, you're tired, exhausted, you want to heal yourself, you have started the uh, healing journey and you, you just keep a low key in your life, like you don't mingle more, you do your business, you do your job, you work and sleep and eat and you're, you have isolated yourself. It's a beautiful card. Six of Wands. So if you are seeking justice in the situation, this will be served to you in the near future because this is a card where people are encouraging, people have recognized uh, your potentials and they have realized your value, your worth. And now uh, since they know your personality, they are encouraging, they are happy to have around you, have you around and uh, they're appreciating and the way you are the way you handle things in the previous past this is going to happen you know you feel like you have achieved something that is going to happen in the near future okay Let's, let me shuffle this card just pop okay queen of wands there's one energy let me read about it one clarification card for the Queen of Wands. Is my voice audible? Let me just check my mic. The Devil. So Capricorns, um, I see an energy. Okay, there's one energy around you and uh, you seem to be addicted with that person. Maybe you have addictions with them, you know, okay. Um, and uh, of course, it has changed your life after having that energy around you because um, you're, you're not even in a relationship you are single but then this energy pops up 
and you're obsessed about them that has changed your life it has made you upset and you're disappointed your cups are falling down the emotions are spilled all over yeah okay so what is one angelic advice or guidelines from the spirits and angels to the single capricorns to judgment you see the situation uh, I explained you the situation, right? How people were unfair with you. They cheated you. They did wrong. You will get justice. Clearly shows. You will get justice. That is the reason this card showed up in the near future. Okay? People were unfair. There was a cheating happen in some situation. And you will get justice. The karma will be served and you will be in this situation in the near future where people are recognizing your hard work and appreciating your skills and hard work and you will feel like this you know like someone who has achieved a lot and you have a chariot card this is a card which is uh, very independent and not in feelings not in emotions that they this is an energy which is aware of uh, right and wrong so that means uh, angels are asking you to be very um, since uh, the past or the current situation shows that people were uh, unfair with you now you will be aware of right and wrong and you will be very independent and uh, you will know the difference between good and bad fair unfair you will easily figure out if people are trying to hurt you cheat you or being deceptive towards you because you are in this powerful chariot energy and uh, this you will gain this uh, maturity the experience the maturity and the personality who can understand people and uh, safeguard themselves you have leveled up you have upgraded yourself because the experience has given you this yeah and when it comes to this uh, energy if since you're sad because of all this happened in the past you know the addictions the uh, another energy and sadness please take care of yourself capricorn things which are meant for you will come to you they will gravitate and you do not have to be sad like this okay please take care of yourself and uh, let us go towards the capricorns who are in relationship what are the current energies of your partner and how do they feel towards you are they thinking about you let me just have a look hangman okay four of swords page of cups how do your partner feel about you right now the world card and two of wands so basically this is a person who, are, who is confused uh, in a dilemma about you of course this is how they feel they do not know they are analyzing they are contemplating the situation they're hurt okay upset having sleepless nights thinking about you page of cups this is a very immature energy and uh, this is a very energetic young energy which uh, created problems themselves in their own life they create their own problems and they suffer by themselves <laughs> their energies are like that you know uh, 
Yeah. Of course, they feel like uh, offering you their world to off vans. It's a kiddish energy who is thinking about you to come back. The world guard, their life uh, is changing. Like they upgrade in every cycle. They are still maturing because the maturity level is very low. I feel funny, you know. I feel when I think about this energy, this is like a cute little kid kind of energy. I don't say they are kid with the age. It's not about age. It's about their personality, you know, a funny kiddy type. And with every cycle, they are going to mature and evolve with a little by little. You know, there's evolution in them, in their personality. So, how do you? feel about your partner the capricorn how do you feel about your partner there's a lot of fights yeah when you deal with a kid there is always a fight isn't it and uh, you want to clear up the space you want to talk and you want to make them understand the energies are are like uh, you are trying to make a baby understand See, this is not the thing. You should not do this. You are supposed to do this. And this is how it works. You are going to explain it that way to your person. And uh, of course the fight. Oh my god. The card just fell down. It flew. It popped. Okay, you have a star card, you want to start fresh with this person. You want to have a new beginning with this person, okay? Knight of Wands, you will just uh, clear what intentions you have towards them. And uh, yes, you want to go towards them, talk to them and sit, decide. What happened in the past, recent past? What happened in the recent past? You have done a lot of hard work on this relation. It's only you who pours your cup and uh, and do a lot of work, isn't it? Queen of Cups, you have feelings, of course. You are like a more mature energy. I, I feel that uh, there is a difference in age. Like one partner is too mature and the other partner is too young for them. There is a difference in age and maturity. This is your energy who is, you know, uh, very grounded, motherly figure, fatherly figure and uh, serious about life offering emotions and feelings yeah you are into this occult sciences you are into reading the energies tarots you're into all that stuff it's a mystic you have a mystic energy okay what happened in recent past there's a lot of love flowing towards each other extraneous love care everything This person is holding on your memories like I don't want to leave you like a small kid shouting for the you know it's it's a that kind of energy you know they aren't uh, letting your memories go So, okay, so what is in the near future, see, so basically the, this was the main reason, the fights, the immaturity, the um, um, decisions which were not supposed to be taken or done, 
I do not want to use this inappropriate word, but the stupidity, okay? I, I have to express, right? Stupidity has caused a lot of chaos in your immaturity and all that. That is the thing. And even in the previous past, you know, the, the energies are beautiful. Too much of love. You have done a lot of hard work. And they're not letting you go. Just things seems to be good in your relationship it's just the immaturity and they do not understand you they don't understand life it's like a very baby energy kiddish and um, what is in the near future what's in the near future between this person the fool <laughs> you see your partner is like a lovey dovey i'm going out i want vacation i want to enjoy kind of carefree person happy go lucky bunny type of person probably you both might travel go on a vacation in the near future a few more cards for the upcoming what is the near future and you're you will take up the challenge of uh, handling this um you know bunny kind of situations you're ready you will take up the challenge and you will stand like a you know warrior and handle the situations even though sometimes it's fr it fr frustrates you what is in the near future why why did i just pick up an energy which is so cute little type i don't know it's so you know it shows it shows why am i seeing this Okay, Ace of Wands and there's a Tower card. Let me just have a... Why there's a Tower card? Let me just have a clarification for the Tower card. Oh my God, it's just fell down. This is like twice. It happened second time, isn't it? Capricorns, why there's a Tower moment? I need a clarification card, Angels. What is the tower moment in the near future? Let me just shuffle it. Why there is a tower moment? There's a sneaky peeky kind of energy. Uh, just uh, make sure that uh, your partner is, you know, transparent with you okay this energy seems to be very sneaky peeky okay and uh, there will be things which you will not know completely there will be things hidden and you need to take care of this and you need a lot of strength also to handle the tower moment because of this things you know there is something which is unknown and uh, there are things which which are not easy to handle and hard and this person uh, hides a lot of things in your back you need a lot of strength to handle all these things that will cause a tower moment one clarification card for Seven of Swords. One clarification cards for Seven of Swords. Judgment card. The judgment will be served. And if things were unsaid and hidden or half truth or if there was some kind of fishy things, it will come out and uh, you will have a discussion about it. You will get judgment and there will be a clear discussion there will be a transparency okay that that will cause some kind of 
tower moment, but you need to have strength. You need to have strength to handle this. Anyway, what is one angelic message or advice for you? Let's see. This is a stubborn energy, chasing energy. What is one angelic message, guidance, or a justice? Just uh, do justice with the situation, do justice with yourself. And if things seem to be unfair, try to uh, be fair with you, yourself. Um, it depends. It depends, okay? So, just be fair in the situation. Be fair with yourself, okay? And uh, justice will be served. In future see there's a lot of judgment and justice both yeah thank you so much Capricorns if this has resonated with you please let me know in the comment section if not please do not be disappointed and please subscribe my channel have a nice day